Amen. Are your chains gone this morning? Have you been set free? Amen. You know, the great news of today is that that amazing grace is free for you. Amen. You don't have to ask for it. He's already given it to you. Amen. You don't have to earn it because Christ already did that on the cross. His amazing grace is free for you. All you have to do is choose it. Yep. You just have to choose it. It reminds me of what my friend Joy Stillman says. He says, you were not born to lose. You were born to choose. Amen? Yeah. Amen. And this morning, God wants you to choose his grace. Yeah. Some of you have been losing far too long. Mm. Some of you have been losing the spiritual battles in your life. Some of you have been losing in your marriage. You've been losing in different areas. And God says, no, I didn't create you to lose. I created you to choose my grace. Amen. But you have to make that choice. That's right. Amen. I hope you've done that today. Yes. This week I've been reading about the names of God. All through the Bible, there are so many, many different names for God, and especially in the New Testament, or excuse me, the Old Testament. Yeah. There are different names depending on what God's people needed for a given situation. I don't know about you, but for me, sometimes God is just, the, the name God is, is so overwhelming. It's, it's so big, and, and sometimes I just need it to be a little more personal, a little more specific. One of the names God says, he says, you can call me Jehovah Yahweh, which means I am always present, Praise God. which means I'm accessible to you. He's Jehovah Yahweh. He's present in your life. He said, you can call me Jehovah Jireh, which means I am the God who provides exactly what you need. He provided a sacrifice for, for Abraham just in the nick of time. But I'm sure he thought it was over. All hope is lost. He came through. Amen. And he'll come through for you as well. Amen. It's so great to see the, the teenagers on the screen and, and to see Bill come up here and see Jehovah Jireh work in their lives. Amen. 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 He came through Amen. for them. He provided for them. Right. And wherever you are today, he will provide for you. Amen. He's Jehovah Jireh. Amen. He also says, I'm Jehovah Rohe, which means I'm the God who heals. And he can bring healing to your life. Yeah. Spiritual healing, emotional healing, physical healing. He will bring healing to your life. Yeah. He says, I'm Jehovah Shalom, which means I'm the God of peace. Yeah. And in the midst of chaos, in the midst of the storm in your life, he says, I am Jehovah Shalom. I want to bring peace to your life. You yeah. just have to choose it. That's right. Oh, and, and my favorite is Jehovah Nisi. Jehovah Nisi, I am the God of victory. Amen. I'm the God, I'm your banner of victory. And, and in the old days, I was reading how when they would go to battle, they would have a, a banner saying what tribe or what country they represented, what country they, who they, it says who they were. Mm -hmm. We are, we are God's people. And when we go to fight, we fight under the banner, under the name of Jehovah Nisi. Mm -hmm. He wants to bring victory to your life. Will you stand with me just right where you are if you're able? If you're able, just stand for a moment and, and bow your heads and, and close your eyes just right where you are. And I don't know what you need in your life right now, but whatever it is, God can provide you. He can bring you peace. He can bring you victory. He can bring you healing. Whatever it is, He has it for you. You just have to choose it. Let's go to him in prayer right now before Pastor Brian comes to bring the word. And I just ask that you would ask the Lord to prepare your heart for the word that he's going to bring today. Because he wants to be exactly what you need this morning. Okay. Heavenly Father, we come before you. God, you are Jehovah. You are all present. And we know that you are present here right now in this place. Yes. I can feel your spirit, Lord. Yes. I pray, God, that as... We go to the as we go to the message and as Brian brings the word and we would hear exactly what you want to speak to us today. Some here today need some healing in their life, Lord. Some today have been losing far too long and they need a victory in their life. Some here, Lord, back away when things get hard and difficult and they need to know that you can provide the strength for Amen. them to get through it. Amen. Oh God, we just come to you this morning. We worship you for who you are. For all your great, amazing 
characteristics, God, we worship you. And we know that you provide what we need. Be here this morning. We love you, Father. We worship you. And all God's people said, Amen. Amen. You may be seated.